Okay, I'm back with um, <laughs> the last video I made. I talked about, I mentioned briefly that I was working out. And you know what else I noticed? In my first two videos, I have on the same t-shirt. <laughs> They're on different days, but I have multiples of the same shirt because um, I'm kind of utilitarian. So once I find something, I buy it in every color. So I have two purple shirts and like three pink ones and four blue ones, all the same style. So I didn't even realize I was wearing another purple shirt, but anyway, it's all good. Um, the exercise part that I said I was doing, um, I use Groker on Roku. I came across it one day, they had a free trial on something, I tried it out, I loved it. Um, if you're looking for something to do at home, this might be a good option for you. It is $5 a month once you your free trial expires. And it's worth it to me because I have an in-home gym, basically. And trainers meet me every day in, in the living room. And I don't have to go anywhere. And right now, uh, you can't go to a gym anyway. So, uh, anyway, I started with the program with Sarah Cush. I don't remember the exact name of it, but it's basically her one of her beginner, easier programs um, because she has some really intense ones on there. So if you're like, you know, extreme athlete, she's got you covered. But um, I had uh, some serious back issues a few years ago, which led to a lot of the weight gain that I've experienced. So um, her videos I was, able to, I was able to do and not have any back problems you know, no damage and, re and injuries or re-injure uh, my, my back where I had a pulled muscle, actually a muscle tear. But anyway, I did that for a few weeks and then recently, in the last couple of weeks, I found this new uh, set of series called Pace and Go and um, it's, a, I believe, a husband and wife team and um, I really enjoy those. Those are, are really focused on strength conditioning, which I really need, um, like with push-ups and squats and things like that. But it's at a level that's not crazy. You know, this isn't like, um, you know, Insanity or, uh, I can't think of the other one, but those really hard programs, which I have tried, by the way, and it was insane. Yeah. So... <laughs> I learned quickly that was not for me. I'm not at that level yet. But um, Groker has a lot of excellent, excellent programs on there. They also have yoga, um, relaxation, meditation, all kinds of things. Lots of things I don't even use because really I just go into my workout. But um, if you're looking for something on Roku and um, you got some time, check it out. So that's what I'm doing. And so far I'm doing it every day. Like I just started... Uh, day one was the 13th on a Monday and I just said you know what I'm gonna do it every day now I think I may take off Sundays but I'm not sure if I feel good I'm going to do it if I feel like I need to rest if I have some pains or you know back issues because it's my number one thing I do not want to re-injure my back because then I can't work out at all so um, I'm going to see how it goes but right now I'm feeling like I'm going to do uh, one of those one of those exercises at least six days a week. Um, I want to buy a bicycle because I'd like to ride a bicycle. I thought that would be cool and a fun way, a different way to get some exercise. And apparently, the rest of America felt the same way during the quarantine. So um, there's literally no bikes around here we have several bike shops in the area no one has bikes Walmart has no bikes now you know if you can't get it from Walmart you're just not gonna get it so um, I'm still waiting on that and I'll get a bike but in the meantime I'm gonna keep this as a core because I need the strength and um, sometimes I do the car a separate cardio with Sarah Cush um, but the strengthening one is really helping me and I know building my core uh, is going to help me as well to prevent future back injuries or any type of injury so the stronger I am the better and my goal is to be an athlete 
I want to be strong, not just lose about a lot of weight and not be strong. I want to lose a lot of weight and be strong. So that's my workout strategy or plan that I uh, use. Oh, and this is one other thing. I was watching another girl, don't remember her name. I'll try to find it if I do. But she also used keto and she lost 130 pounds in like less than a year. And uh, she said she always worked out in the morning before she ate. So I switched up when I worked out and changed it to a few hours before my eating window, which is around two o'clock. So I try to work out in the mornings. Well, I do work out in the morning and I do it before I have to eat. Um, because she said exercising uh, fasted worked better for her and hey she's lost 130 pounds so um, I've lost seven <laughs> I'm going with her so we'll see how that works so far so good um, I'll talk to you guys soon bye bye